Good morning, YouTube, and happy Saturday. I just woke up a few minutes ago, but there are a few things I want to do today. Today is actually my last weekend before I leave for Oregon again. So next weekend, I will be getting on a train and heading to Oregon for a whole month, and then I will be coming back. It's basically gonna be the whole situation again where I come back and have to go on a few trips work so that is my life at the moment but I knew I wanted to do something today so we are going to get ready and have a good day try to take some pictures with that as my background. A few things. One, it's really crazy to think how like around this time last year I was living downtown and would be so scared to take pictures like out in the open because all the homeless and now I'm like in a really nice neighborhood taking pictures. Thumbnail. All right. Oh yeah. And then the other thing, it's really... Obviously, I'm in the neighborhood, so it's really um, nerve-wracking to do this in public, but I do it all the time, so here we go. Oh my god, I'm probably never doing that again. You never really know what's gonna happen when you set up a camera and start posing in the middle of the street, but the house right next to me's dog started barking and so the owner came out and he was like, oh, you're the person he's so excited about. And I was like, yeah, I guess there's a rooster. Um, <laughs> oh, and then some old lady came out and I thought she was like mad at me for taking pictures on of people's property. And I couldn't hear her and I didn't really want to deal with it. I'm just like, yeah, I'm just taking pictures of myself. But then she like kept staring at me and the dog kept barking. So <laughs> I like ran over to her. I tried to explain. I was like, I'm taking Instagram pictures. She's like, Instagram? Oh, like I thought you were marking the place down for like robbery or something. Cause honestly, it do be like that out here sometimes. I was like, no, I'm just taking pictures of myself. So she was like, oh, enjoy. I was like, okay. Hopefully we got some good pictures. I didn't really want to stay there any longer. The dog kept barking and I just felt weird. So I don't know if I said, but now we are off to the mall, kind of. I want to go to a cafe. Like that's just really what I want to do is go to a cafe, sit outside, listen to music. And I don't really know of any like cute cafe areas around here. So I'm going to go to Glendale the Glendale Mall and there's a Target there too which I could use some groceries so that's what we're gonna do today this song has been my literal obsession literally can't stop playing it We've made it! Here is the place. It looks so cute to just like sit down and have a coffee. I haven't had coffee yet. 
Concert here, 1775. Could I also get a water, if that's okay? Just like a cup of water. Thank you. All right, I got avocado toast. Thank God, because I have not eaten today yet, and it's noon, so a little late breakfast, and a honey oat latte. I haven't tried it yet, so let's do a little taste test. Mm, it's interesting. It's good, but the best avocado toast I've ever had was at this like Mexican cafe kind of thing in downtown, and it was on like a croissant bread. It was super good. My latte is really good. I would say this is like 7 out of 10. Well, this is like 8 out of 10. It's a pretty good place. It's in a really cute area too. So I'm just gonna chill here. You look at the pictures that I took on you, the camera. Edit some TikToks. Just chill out. so hot out today. I'm about to put my top down. I haven't done that in a long time, so I'm really excited. I'm gonna drive home with the vibes going, but I wanted to show you really quickly what I got from Target. First, I got a strawberry vanilla Olipop for the road. It's only like a 30 minute drive, but gotta love a car drink. And then I got gluten-free, dairy-free pizza. This is actually really good. I mean, it sounds a little sus. Spinach, this cabbage mix. These are pretty fire. Kind of expensive. I got some milk chocolate covered peanuts. Hope these don't melt. It's like 70 degrees. And then an onion and avocados. I really tried not to get a lot since I am leaving literally a week from today. I just have all this week and then I am starting my journey back to Oregon. And I say journey because it is going to be like a 26 hour train ride. So I'm hoping I sleep, but also something about me is just I love window watching. I love sitting out the window. I love looking at the view. I think like a real life Polar Express would just be so cool. I probably won't ever do that again because it's so long, like maybe a shorter one. But yeah, it'll be a real life Polar Express. I hope it's like snowy on the mountain somewhere or something. I don't really know. You guys will know next week. That will be a very exciting video, but let's get this top down. I'm so excited! <laughs> Yes! Gotta put my hair up because it is absolutely brutal on the highway, especially if I'm trying to go fast. Sunglasses on. Someone's pulling up next to me. Take a selfie. Get the vibes going. Nah. Just got back home. I love driving with the top down. I just feel so cool. Nothing really like screams sunny day in LA. Like driving down the road with the top down, blasting music. When I moved here to LA, I knew I wanted a convertible. I knew I wanted to be one of those people cruising down the streets with their top down. I love my car. I absolutely love my car. But I'm gonna put these away real fast. And since it is 
really nice outside. I think I want to go. I really would love to go in the pool. I haven't been in the pool yet since I moved here. But I don't think it's that warm. Plus, it's a little cloudy now. So I feel like I'd probably get cold. But there's definitely still stuff that I can do on my phone so i'm just gonna go vibe out outside and continue this really good day that we're having me out here vibing i wish it was warm enough to go in the pool but summer is coming the weather is getting warmer and it's staying lighter longer i actually think daylight saving time ends soon so i'm so excited for summer can't wait to go to the beach and finally like go in this pool also, only one picture turned out that like wasn't blurry. This one is okay. It wouldn't be like my top pick, but literally all of them turned out blurry. It's kind of cute. We'll post it. Why not? All right, I am back inside now. I'm going to make dinner. It is a little past five. I'm going to make this like Brussels sprout, broccoli, quinoa, spinach, bowl mix usually i would make it with tofu but i have these meatless chicken tenders that literally taste like chicken they're so good put those in the air fryer and get some dinner going And dinner is served. This is literally so good. I've been having this like the past few days, but I just used up the rest of the quinoa and the noodles, so we'll probably have something new tomorrow. But there is the meatless meat, um, spinach, which usually I would do kale, and then broccoli, Brussels sprouts, and usually there would be avocado as well, but I didn't have any, and coconut aminos, which is key. And yeah, super good. Just finished up dinner and did the dishes. I'm gonna take my makeup off now, sadly. You know when you feel like the makeup should have deserved more attention? I feel like I didn't do much today. Well, at least I got a few cute Instagram pictures. But I am breaking out so bad. I feel like this one just grew twice today twice its size. Putting on makeup always makes me break out. I feel like I should definitely look into getting new products like foundation but i just feel like makeup in general is not really good for you but i also think that i am going to start my period soon and i'm breaking out been a little cranky lately too so every time i'm cranky and then my period comes i'm like that makes sense yeah, it makes sense so crazy that I'm going back to Oregon next weekend. I'm super excited to see my sister. I think I said that I'm going to stay with my sister for a week and then go to Redmond, which is three hours away, and stay at my parents' house and see all my friends. <laughs> I think that this might be like the last time that I'm doing the one month here, one month there thing for a while. Like, I may just come back here. I might go back to Oregon in May just because. I'm gonna be with my family for my grandma's birthday, so I might as well just go back to Oregon. But then I'll probably stay like for a little bit at least in the summer, like definitely in the summer. Summers in LA are my favorite. I'm microwaving the last Sweet Lorenz cookie. <laughs> I was going to get some more at Target, but I guess they didn't have any. I'm also going to eat some ice cream. <laughs> As you can tell, I am a little snacky, but these, I've been obsessed with these lately. I wish I had some for this week.
just put a few clothes aside for my <laughs> trip i guess next weekend i don't know what to call it the polar express adventure begins next week <laughs> I'm really excited for that video. It's going to be so cool. I've seen so many TikToks of people doing that, hopefully that exact train ride because it looked really cool in their videos, but it's going to be cool regardless. Good morning, by the way. It is the next day. I just had breakfast and cleaned up my apartment a little bit. I just need to do the dishes and then I'm probably just going to have a chill day. I started the morning off sitting outside on the pool chairs. That's been like I love doing that. I've been doing that the past few days and even though it was a little cold <laughs> this morning, it still puts me in a better mood just like being outside. Anyways, I'm gonna end this video here and my next video is gonna be so exciting. Can't wait for that. Thank you so much if you've watched it this far and if you have watched it this far, comment the coffee emoji because we got coffee yesterday. It was really good. I'm gonna enjoy the rest of my Sunday. I hope you enjoy the rest of your day or night. I'll see you next week.